you could go through our team throughout the month of October and it probably could have went to any player because we we've, we've, have played really well. Um, looking at October at the start of the season, you know, it did look like a tough month for us. We're away to Porter Down, who are probably favourites for the league. And we also had a derby in there with Harden and with Welders. So, yeah, um, obviously one of the games was called off, but the three games that we did play um, were won, which was always good. And before the start of the season, were you setting any particular expectations as a team, or were you setting any expectations for yourself, or is it very much just one game at a time and see where it takes you? Yeah, I think it's always that old cliche, one game at a time and see where it takes you. I mean, internally, I think I know what we can achieve. You know, you look through throughout our changing room, there is that experience there and boys that have been there and won things. And we also have that mix of youthful players that's coming through, maybe starting their careers or starting to get first team opportunities. Um, so yeah, internally we know what we can achieve. We're not running around shaking in the media what we, what we can achieve. Um, and yeah, we'll just take it one game at a time. And how have you found life at, at Wilgar and the done so far? Um, the club's obviously got new stands and they're building another one. How have you found life at the, at the Duns? Yeah, to be fair, I'm really enjoying my football. Um, obviously I've played for, for Glen Avon for, for seven years and, and at the time I wasn't playing towards the end of that. I wasn't playing too often. So I just thought a change would be good. I kind of I took kind of three or four months out of football, um, and I found out from there I was really missing it. So, yeah, I got a call from from the Duns at the time and and signed for them. And yeah, I haven't really looked back. Um, it's a club you can see that's that's on the pro the progression. Um, they're obviously starting to to change things in and around the club. They're building new stands. So yeah, it's a club that's firmly on the up, and long may that continue. The league's so competitive, but it's so entertaining, and there's crowds, and you know. It's a great league to be involved in. What, what's your thoughts on the championship so far this season? Yeah, no, the championship is very competitive. You know, I, I played there previously um, with Bangor about, about eight years ago, and yeah, the, the quality does seem to have went up um, from that. I mean, that could be due to you know teams in the Premier League now going full time, so you're potentially getting some part time players that are dropping down to that league. But um, as I say, yeah, we're, we're sitting top of the league and, and we've lost three games. I think everyone in the league has lost three games at least, so it shows you how competitive the league is. And I'm sure that's great for a neutral, but um, like we're just looking to take care of ourselves and hopefully Dundella can keep winning games of football.